Hey, what's up guys? It's your girl Alondra coming back to you guys again with another video. As you guys can see by the title of this video, I will be showing you guys a few different outfits that I hope that will be able to inspire your guys' outfits for BTS's upcoming concerts in LA. By the time I upload this, the concert will actually be in the next two days. I know this video is kind of late because you guys are probably like, Miss Girl, we got our fits already, but... I know Damo that there are still some armies out there that have absolutely no idea what they are going to wear. For this video, I put together five different outfits that you guys can take inspiration from. Before I get started with this video, I just wanted to let you guys know that I am not a fashion icon. I am not a fashionista. Fashionista? Fashionista? I think it's fashionista, so I'm going to say fashionista. Therefore, please do not judge my fits. These outfits are just what happen to be in my closet, and I tend to wear most of them on a day-to-day -day basis. I know that a lot of K-pop Stands are new to this community and I feel like K-pop has definitely influenced our style and I know that there are a lot of new people in the community that wish they could have a different type of style but they just don't know where to start so even if this video is not BTS outfit concert worthy I hope that it can inspire your guys' fits and allow you guys to get out of your comfort zone if you guys haven't followed me on instagram for a while i'm pretty sure you guys can see how much my style has changed by the time i upload this the next day will be friday which means black friday so i hope that if you guys do go shopping on friday you guys are able to find clothes for a very cheap price i know we are all broke after the tickets went on sale. I am so glad to have gotten access to pre-sale. Well, I didn't get access, but my friend did, and she was able to buy me a ticket. So thank you, Pam, if you are watching this. In no way am I expecting you guys to recreate the same exact outfit. But I really do hope that it helps you guys get a start at what you guys are going to wear for the BTS concert, or just a start in how you are going to start changing up your style a little bit. If you weren't able to get BTS concert tickets, it's okay. Do not worry, because I will be uploading a vlog of me at the bts concert very soon i am actually going to their december 2nd show which is their last show so i am going to be in tears so until then please stay tuned for my bts in la concert vlog without further ado let's get into the video so to start off i actually got this green cardigan at h&m and these pants are from levi's and the shoes that i am wearing are air forces i think that this is definitely a very cute yet casual but not too casual simple outfit that i think is a appropriate for honestly any kind of event unless you're going to the red carpet i do not recommend that you wear this but if it's like a concert if you're just going out for dinner if you're just going to school if you want to feel like well put together this is definitely like an outfit that says all of that that does all of that i don't know why but this outfit is very much reminding me of this namjoon outfit and this tay outfit i know that the colors are not exactly alike but they do happen to be in the same color scheme also i hope you guys know that i was not I'm trying to recreate one of the bts members outfits this outfit was actually the outfit that i wore today i went out with my friends honestly i think that a knit cardigan can honestly go well with just a regular pair of blue jeans i honestly feel like this will look good with any color pants i actually wore this cardigan with some brown pants and it was actually a really nice outfit. Yes, I did look like the main guy of Scooby-Doo, but I mean, it was cute. She was cute. Moving on is this outfit. I got these pants off of Shein, and I also got this shirt off of Shein. And I got this blazer jacket thrifting, and the shoes are the Converse Run Star Hikes, I believe. This is actually the outfit that I wore to Harry Styles' concert. This fit is giving me very much Yoongi Dynamite vibes. Once again, I was not trying to recreate his outfit. I just simply put it on and I was like, hey, I've seen this somewhere. I just can't exactly remember where. And then the other day it hit me, hey, it's Yoongi Dynamite. I feel like this outfit is very much K-Style inspired. The blazer jacket puts it all together. The blazer jacket really gives it a very fancy look. I think blazer jackets are just so cute and appropriate for 
all events, even red carpet events. And I definitely think that blazers should be normalized because I feel like they're very normalized in Korea, but I feel like here, you know, in the States, if you were to wear a blazer, people assume that you're going to do something very businessy wise. And I'm just like, mm, no, I just wanted to look rich and cool. Moving on to our third outfit. This is the outfit that I am actually planning to wear to the BTS concert. It gives off very much preppy girl vibes and that isn't usually my style but like I said you always have to start somewhere. I definitely am very into the whole preppy girl aesthetic and I really want that to be my aesthetic. However, it's kind of hard especially with someone my body shape and body size um please remember that no matter your shape or size you are beautiful no matter what i got the black vest from this store called fashion q i also happen to get the skirt there and the big oversized button up white shirt is from shein and the boots that i am wearing are doc martens i definitely think that this outfit would look 10 times better with stockings or long black socks i think it would give it more of a school preppy girl vibe so do not mind my legs i have not shaved them honestly i've just been way too lazy to shave yes i am going to shave for the bts concert you don't have to shave your legs though if you don't feel like it but personally i am very insecure and if someone just stares at me i feel like they're judging me and i cannot take that i am not mentally stable for that therefore i'm going to shave my legs but not right now this outfit i honestly fell in love with this outfit this was my first time actually putting on this outfit and honestly it fit me better than i thought it would so shout out to fashion q moving on to the next outfit i got the corset and the white button up oversized shirt off of shein and i got these thigh high boots at this store at my local mall I forgot the name of the store though. I actually wore this outfit to homecoming and all I'm gonna tell you was all eyes were on me. They really were. Not trying to sound cocky, but when people saw my fit, they were like, you are insane. I was getting compliments all night. Like this outfit is giving me very much like, don't F with me. I actually got this inspiration from Irene, I believe. Was No, who was it? It was a Red Velvet member. Oh my gosh, I forgot her name. Was it Irene? I think it was Irene. When she danced with Taeyong, I forgot I was award show, but she wore the same exact outfit. And girl, I just felt like a Red Velvet member the whole night at homecoming. It made me feel so good about myself. Yes, it was definitely out of my comfort zone. If you're willing to wear this, go for it. Go for it. I promise you it is going to look good on you. I feel like this outfit looks good on anyone and everyone. I'm not the type to like hype myself up at all whatsoever but every time i put this outfit on i feel unstoppable i feel so good about myself so definitely wear this if you do not have something to wear all i am saying is if you do not know what to wear just wear this this is the fit you have to wear if you do not know what to wear moving on to the last and final fit this fit is actually very casual to me but also i need you guys to keep in mind that the concerts will be held in an outdoor stadium yes they do close it but from what i know it is open most of the time and i'm pretty sure they're gonna keep it open because bts tends to have fireworks at the end of every show i don't know if they're gonna do it at these concerts but i wouldn't doubt it if they did so it's gonna be cold i know you guys probably think you know la is hot which it is but when the cold season kicks in baby girl it oh my gosh la is something else you guys are probably like girl what do you know about la girl i live in la i was born and raised in la i am not someone who was born somewhere else and then moved to LA for the hype. No. Girl, you really think I would move here and pay this much money just to have a home? I mean, I mean, I don't pay it, but like my family, you know, like it, LA is expensive. It really is. So if you just want to be cozy and warm, but not too warm, but just perfectly warm enough, I feel like this outfit is definitely an outfit you should wear. I got these pants off of Shein. I got the sweater from H&M. And once again, I am wearing my Converse Run Star Hike. This is a fit that you should wear if you know you're still trying to look good but cozy cute and cozy we're gonna put it that way you know you can maybe add like a turtleneck under it would look just perfect i really hope that you guys got some inspiration from these outfits please 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 if you guys did get any inspiration from this video 
please tag me in your guys' Instagram post. I want to hype you guys up to the max. I want to see the baddies that you guys are, okay? And plus, it's always nice to make new friends. And if you don't want to tag me in your picture, it's okay. Just DM me and be like, hey, look, I got some inspo off of your video. Can you please like my post? Can you please hype it up? I will gladly do it. Just send me your post, tag me in it, do whatever you want. Let me see it, okay? Let me hype you up. I really hope this, this video helped you guys. And if it didn't, well, thank you for viewing my video. And I will see you guys next week in my BTS concert vlog. I love you guys and I will see you guys soon.